This is a one-minute update by Scienza, the value science company. Hey everyone, here's a brief rundown of the recent meetings of the four subgroups within the Member State Coordination Group on Health Technology Assessment that occurred on April 24th and April 25th in Brussels. These meetings touched on the new HTA IT platform, as well as elected chairs and co-chairs for each subgroup. In the development of methodological and procedural guidance subgroup, Interim Chair Roisin Adams handed over the reins to newly elected Chair Beta Wiesler and Co-Chair Sarah Kuto. This subgroup will focus on setting internal procedures and fostering cooperation with other subgroups and regulatory bodies. For the Joint Clinical Assessment subgroup, Interim Chair Roisin. Adams passed the baton to Chair Paul de Boissieu and Co-Chair Anne Willemson. Their aim is to collaborate with the methodology subgroup and implement joint exercises before 2025 to evaluate the system. The Joint Scientific Consultation subgroup with Nicholas Hedberg as Interim Chair chose Stephanie Said as Chair and Gergo Meres as Co-Chair. Their plan is to work closely with the European Medicines Agency and the Medical Device Coordination Group while taking resource capacities into account for future endeavours. Lastly, the Emerging Health Technologies subgroup led by Interim Chair Marco Marchetti, selected Kim helleberg madsen as Chair and Yelena Ivanovic as Co-Chair. This subgroup will concentrate on exploring emerging technologies and maintaining strong partnerships with other subgroups, regulators and stakeholders. Don't forget to watch out for the upcoming virtual meetings in May. Thanks for listening to our update. If you enjoyed what you heard today, please take a moment to like and comment. Your support helps us reach more listeners and grow our community. So don't be shy. Let us know what you think.